Because we wanted to make a film about young people, we wanted to make it with them. I'm get my own breath and you see it <laughs> The first step was to assemble a team. I mean, I'm very far removed from being a teenager and I knew that to tell this story I needed to work with people from the community, I needed to work with the young people themselves. How's your mum doing? Yeah, she's fine. Yeah? Yeah. And we went into schools and youth hubs and we found the girls before we developed the script, which is unusual because usually when you're casting you're looking for a very particular kind of character. But the collaboration extended not just through the development process but right into the shoot and even the post. Everybody's voice was heard. I was learning as much from them as they were from me. If I was learning more, to be honest. All these young women were bringing a lot to the table. They were contributing to the world of the film and the development of their own characters. I mean, they were playing fictional characters, but they were very much drawing on worlds they knew. So we made an early decision that we needed two cameras because that allowed more freedom in the edit. It meant that we didn't have to make the girls hit marks and do the same thing in every take, because at least we had some, some coverage on that. And we tried as much as possible to light as naturally as possible, to give the girls as much freedom as possible to move as they wanted. We did silent roles, we didn't say action, um, we ran, we, we, got, had, <laughs> we ended up with 150 hours of footage in the cutting room, which is more than I've ever had on any film. I definitely learned a lot from these girls and I learned, I, I respect them hugely. I mean, they're really, really wise, they're really smart, they're and they're really thoughtful. They're, they're more than I could ever have dreamed of, actually. I mean, they've just, and they've grown through this journey. And it makes me realize what, you know, we didn't create these girls, they were there, and we were lucky enough to work with them. 